why God must kill before he can make a life I want to walk in the full weight of God's help I don't want this kind of testimony that the man's hand is inside I'm not saying God will not use man but you know there are many jobs people receive and they came and say well I got a job with NMPC is a lie the guy paid 400,000 naira to secure it for men have forgotten this part and Samuel was teaching us he said you see you will not just come to God and say you want help God doesn't just help any man the highest you can get is divine intervention you will get some time but he said if you want to work in the full weight of my help there is something you will embrace genuine repentance after your heart has turned to the Lord you will now do away with the gods the foreign gods and the Asherah when you do away you will now prepare your heart to serve him only that means you will know nothing but God I have learned that before God can commit himself to you he will strip you of everything Sama do you want God to invest his jealousy on you that even if you say pure water, it will say you need a turning away from the way of the world. I'm not talking about fornication alone. Neither am I talking about adultery alone. I'm talking about a people that are prepared to house God. The only thing they know is God. The only language they know is God. God. the only way they know is God father I pray make me that man I know they may be scarce but oh God do to me what only you can do till I become that man that the only thing I see is a way that is narrow only few find it that's why it's a narrow path it will chisel you of many weights weight and sin are not the same so he tells you that the weight will go away he's not just talking about sin there are many garbages you've carried you have learned the way of evil men they taught you that this is how to be wise but god is trying to say that in order for you to secure a penisa you will leave evil men because you are not just an evil man in time you are now a new creature and if you are a new creature in order for you not to be darkened by the gods of this world that blindfolds the minds of men there is something you will engage it is called renewal of the mind so every day you will take the theology that they taught you in chemistry the one you learned in biology you will bring it under the array of true light because there is a light in this world but the problem of that light is that it is darkness you see the technology of the world is that it gives you good but that good has evil that's why it tells you there is a tree of the knowledge of good and evil so everything the world will give you it will attract you by the good advantage but behind it there is a way that seems right to a man but the problem is the end the end and the ways of death so he says in order for men at the christian Sokoto to secure great and mighty help from me there is a path they must follow there is a path they must stay it is a part of genuine repentance and genuine repentance begins when men turn their heart to god after they turn their heart to god the next thing they put away the gods of the asphalt and the foreign gods the next thing they prepare their heart only for god and when they do that they will serve him only which god do you know you have known the ways of evil men it's time to know the way of god you want the help of god he raises the poor how about the boss he leaves the beggar from the donkey you have a place with the prince the beautiful thing about these secrets that we share no man has power to keep it to himself what i'm trying to tell you is that if somewhere walk in the reality of it my brother you can walk in it those online you can walk in it the reason why scriptures were given according to romans chapter 15 verse 4 it says they were written for example that all still hope and christians are and comfort of the scripture my half hope so i have seen the bonisa samuel walking in bonisa and when samuel was unveiling obey ah samuel walked in bonisa to a point whereby during dry season he told the people that god bear me witness i have not taken a ram from you and if that is true let rain fall and immediately rain fell that is a bonisa god hears you because that man walks in the way of the new repentance we have fake repentance fake plenty fake repentance you slept with somebody today did this number no well i'm trying to work on him who's that he said you will take away the gods of the ashtagoth genuine repentance god is not just looking for your tears you begin from the place of your tears but my brother there is a place i don't just want to excite you i know last week you were shouting amen but i want this thing to stay forever i want you to stay in sokoto because brother, the lord told me you will export this gospel to the ends of the earth you he says you 
you see, your location is not the problem. It's the person behind you in your location that matters. Because you see, the earth is of the Lord. The fullness there of the world and all the that dwell there. He is the one. He says promotion is not from the east or from the west. Promotion is from the Lord. You see, I used to say this, that success is not doing big things. You are the one who thinks you need plenty connection. If you walk in, what oh, one neighbor? Asamba tato kamala to kapas. 